The Danish government has announced its intention to approve a military aid package worth nearly 1 billion euros for Ukraine. Presented by Danish Prime Minister Meta Frederiksen, the package includes tanks, ammunition, drones, and other equipment. The announcement was made during a press conference with Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky and the heads of state of Norway, Finland, Iceland, and Sweden. However, the Danish Prime Minister did not specify the number or model of tanks to be delivered to the Ukrainian armed forces. Denmark has already played an active role in supporting Ukraine since the beginning of the conflict. In the past, the country has provided a variety of military equipment, including light weapons, communication systems, and training for Ukrainian forces. It should be noted that Denmark has delivered Leopard 1A5 DK tanks to the Ukrainian armed forces. In addition to this package, Denmark may consider providing additional military equipment in the future, depending on the needs on the ground and the evolving situation. Future discussions could include the delivery of additional armored vehicles, air defense systems, and logistical support. The package includes combat tanks, although the specific model has not been disclosed. However, according to the, the Military Balance 2022 report, the Danish army has two major variants of the Leopard 2 tank, the Leopard 2A5 and the Leopard 2A7V. However, it is unlikely that these tanks will be given to the Ukrainian armed forces. The Leopard 2A5, initially deployed, is known for its significant improvements in protection and sighting systems compared to its predecessors. This variant marked a notable advance in combat tank design, offering better protection against anti-tank munitions thanks to additional armor at the front of the turret and chassis. Moreover, the Leopard 2A5 is equipped with an advanced fire control system, enhancing its accuracy and reliability on the battlefield. The Leopard 2A7V, on the other hand, represents a more recent and advanced evolution. Considered one of the most modern variants of the Leopard 2 tank, it incorporates significant technological improvements. It offers better protection, increased firepower, and improved mobility. The 2A7V is equipped with the latest generation 120mm cannon and an advanced combat management system, allowing it to operate effectively in various combat environments, including urban areas. This variant is also designed for better survival on the battlefield, with improved protection systems against explosive threats and armor-piercing projectiles. These two variants of the Leopard 2 tank, with their distinct capabilities, represent a major asset for the Danish armed forces. Their advanced technology, firepower, and mobility make them suitable for a wide range of military operations, affirming Denmark's status as a significant contributor in the field of European defense. International aid does not seem to be weakening, at least in terms of Europe. However, the main support comes from the United States, which appears to be increasingly reluctant to send equipment to the Ukrainian armed forces, especially with the approaching presidential elections.